Okay guys, I'm going to try a experiment in aerosols and what we're going to do is we're going to take some rust oleum products, primer, gloss black, and silver metallic and put them to a test and see what it, the final result looks like. We're going to layer them on there a little bit at a time and I'll keep cutting back to this until we get a finished product. And the test the test piece is going to be a little headlight bracket. And there's just one coat, quick and easy. I'll let that dry. And, uh, Yeah, then we'll put the black on, then we'll put the chrome on and see what it looks like. So these are the products I'm going to be using in the aerosol experiment. This one thought you might want to see what it is I'm doing. Got Rust-Oleum Rusty Metal Primer, Rust-Oleum Gloss Black, and Krylon Metallic Special Purpose Bright Finish Interior. I don't know why, that's what we're trying. Okay, for the aerosol experiment part two, I'm going to hit this with a little bit of black. Just a thin coat. And we'll let that dry. And then we'll try the uh, metallic finish and see how that turns out. All right guys, I'm gonna do the last stage of the aerosol experiment with this uh, Krylon metallic wannabe chrome looking stuff. And then I'm gonna spray a little on here. I got the piece right here. Kinda has a sparkle to it. Kinda resembles metal plate. Alright. I can tell right now it's not gonna have a chrome or that reflective finish, but it'll have a uh, more like a just a silvery metal look. Yeah. Anyway. I'm going to mow the grass and we'll come back and fond a little bit, see how it, uh, see how it turns out. It needs clear coat on it on top of that, but I don't have any offhand. I might have some. I have to look around. All right, guys, I got my yard mowed, and we're coming back to look at this little piece. And uh, I'll tell you what. I know it's got some runs in it, and it, I didn't sand it down or anything in between the little coats, and I should have. But this was just a quick experiment to see what this final product was looking like. And uh, I'll tell you what, I'm not disliking this. That's just a neat little process. And it, it doesn't look like chrome, and it's not really going to ever look like chrome, no matter even if it has clear coat on it. But it does look like a metallic finish, and it's not going to rust. And so. There's a cheap way to spruce up your projects, huh? Yeah. So, now we know. So the aerosol experiment is actually a success. And, uh, I think I can utilize that in my project. Because chroming is going by the wayside due to chemical environmental protection agencies and things like that. Uh, getting chroming actually done is expensive if you can find it and get it done. And yeah, it's just a major pain in the keister, and especially for a little project like this bike I'm building. You don't want to spend a gob of money getting something chrome plated, you know? Do you? <laughs> I don't. Uh, but this is a good alternative for a good cheap spruce up. 
and uh, yeah so I'm calling it a thumbs up you let me know what you think and uh, of course I'm gonna have to redo this and sand it down and get the runs and stuff out of it and redo it but now we know what the final product looks like and I'm pleased with that that'll be just fine yeah all right I'll see you guys thanks for watching now what am I gonna do oh my okay